Hi there. Thanks for sticking with us on this blue Friday, on this Friday the 13th. A beautiful shot out here looking at the Space Needle this morning. 45 degrees is your, ta uh, is your temp out there. 823 is the time, and MJ will have your full forecast. Coming up, the Hawks play the Panthers in Carolina on Sunday. All right, we've got our menus picked out for our human guests this holiday season, but what about our four-legged friends? So Just Food for Dogs, a company that made it onto Ellen's favorite things list for their commitment to serving man's best friend a whole food diet. And this morning, Ellen, you're showing us yeah. some holiday foods that the company is offering there, and you brought your friend. You know what? I brought my best friend. This is Charlie. And you know what? It's not even just holiday meals that the, this company is offering. It's holiday meals that you can make at home. So let me show you over here. Right behind us is uh, food that we might have for the holidays, right? These are great vegetables. Uh, but even though they are vegetables, they're not good for human cons consumption. In fact, my dog is like, give me the, that food. All right. Hang on, Charlie. Um, so, But what we do have over here is Dr. Jessica. I'm hey really guys. hoping my dog does not bark the entire segment. He may. But let's talk about what we can cook for our dogs this holiday season that does keep them healthy and part of the family. You start cooking, I'll grab him. All right, so I want to show you guys. Here we have our already cooked recipe, but we've got ground turkey. We have fortified whole wheat pasta. We've got zucchini, carrots, broccoli. Here we've got some cranberries as well. Um, here are some omega-3 fish oil. This is actually a vitamin and mineral blend that's specific for this recipe, so that it's fully balanced for dogs. And so here we have this wonderful recipe that is okay for even us to eat. And in fact, we're probably going to try it. And she's not it, lying when she I'm says that. Lying. Because last time we did these segments, it was back in August. She was like, "Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna eat we're gonna some of this. this." And I'm like. Really? Yeah. And it was it was pretty good. <laughs> the only thing missing was seasoning, which again, right. seasoning good for us, not good for our animals. Mm -hmm. um, now, I really quickly want to talk yeah. about how, yes, we can make these recipes at home, right? Like Absolutely. we're using whole ingredients, um, or you can come to a Just Food for Dog shop. But what if there's not a Just Food for Dog, say, in Olympia? There are other places to get them Absolutely. in, like, you know, Bellingham. Yes. Where is that? Yes. So we are carried at, so you can come here to our kitchen in Seattle, or we are carried at certain Petco's. So if you go on the Petco website or even on the Just yeah. Food for Dog's website, you can actually search um, the, which closest Petco may carry us. And then here's another thing, like we do for you, Ellen, we can ship it directly to your yeah. home. And we have one more option. Literally how you see us cooking this here, we give you that option. So we have do-it-yourself meal kits. So that's what this supplement powder is. So we give you the recipe, and that's what comes in this pamphlet right here, so that you can purchase all of the ingredients and cook this at home, and then you know it's balanced right. and you by know veterinarians. It's, and it's yeah. good for your dog, because yes. again, Dr. Jessica doesn't just play a uh, veterinarian on TV, <laughs> she really is one. Coming up next hour, we're gonna do a little bit of a taste test, and again, show you more about how you can He's include excited. the dogs in your holiday meals. and. Yes, my dog is totally yes. fishing for pumpkin healthy <laughs> treats. Oh, there yes. he is. Uh, guys, gonna send it back out over to you. And Charlie's she having the best day of work ever. Okay, oh, yes. Ellen, thank you.